The world is reacting to the news that Osama bin Laden has been killed by U.S. forces from Europe to the Middle East to Asia. World leaders are praising the news as NBC's Richard Engel shows us the attack on bin Laden getting a lot of support. It may be a mark of how hated he was. Within hours of the announcement of Osama bin Laden's death, international congratulations poured in. This news will be welcomed right across our country. Of course, it does not mark the end of the threat we face from extremist terror. I welcome the death of Osama bin Laden. I welcome this news. The world will become a better world without him. In statements, Germany and France expressed relief, but cautioned this will not stop the threat of terrorism. Afghan President Hamid Karzai, who rules where bin Laden launched the 9-11 attacks, said Al-Qaeda has murdered and harmed our people for many years. I hope terrorism will meet its fate with the killing of bin Laden. <laughs> Yemen, bin Laden's ancestral homeland, welcomed the American covert action and encouraged more of them. A Yemeni official said, we hope that targeted measures will be taken to end terrorism throughout the world. Even the Vatican said that while Christians do not rejoice over a death, Osama bin Laden, quote, had the grave responsibility of having spread division and hate and of exploiting religion for these purposes. Times are, are changing rapidly across the, the Middle East right now. Revolutions, waves of democracy, and people in the Arab world hope that with Osama bin Laden gone and this new political climate, perhaps a turning point may be coming. Richard Engel, NBC News, Benghazi.